Well, a very special train is rolling full steam ahead into Northeast Iowa, and this is the eighth year for the Snowflake Express. Today it made a stop in Waterloo to spread some Christmas cheer. KWWL's Vinnie Lowry got, a, got to ride on that train today and shows us how the train has made an impact on many through the years. We're immediately thinking of how can we give back, how can we try to help others. That's kind of how this whole train came to be. Passengers waiting to board the Snowflake Express. This Christmas train isn't going to the North Pole, but through the Cedar Valley. Kind of brings it back to the feeling of an old time Christmas. The train is one of the main fundraisers for Magical Mix Kids, a nonprofit taking chronic and terminally ill children to Disney World. William McGee has overseen this operation from the beginning years ago, after his daughter won a battle against leukemia and was chosen to be a Magical Mix kid. It's amazing to me the families that are, are Magical Mix families, they come back in droves to help make this happen. And it could not happen without them and their involvement and their willingness to come and spend a whole day here. This is a lot of work. It's fun, but it's also a lot of work. More than 100 volunteers help spread holiday cheer to this year's 5,000 passengers. Are you having fun? Did you talk to Santa? Some of the volunteers are even magical mix kids giving back. So it really just gives them a chance to, you know, get outside of their home, do something fun even while they're sick. I like seeing the kids' reaction because they're like dancing and all that. We all yell Santa is coming and then he comes in and then they're all like oh my gosh it's Santa. The train made its final trip for the season and now it'll be stored until next year. Reporting in Waterloo, Vinny Lowry, News 7 KWWL. Now organizers say they hope to raise about $80,000 for the Magical Mix Kids organization.